Hello champions, how are you? <clears throat> so there's an another question and the question says that the graph shows the variation with distance of a horizontal force acting on an object. So there's an object like this. And there is a force. And the force Fs graph is given. The object initially is at rest. So the initial velocity is zero. Moves horizontally through a distance 50. So suppose this is 50 meters and it reaches here. <clears throat> Constant frictional force of 2 Newton opposes the motion. <clears throat> there is a frictional force also that is of 2 Newton. What is the final kinetic energy of the object when it has moved 50 meters? So when the object is here, we have to calculate the kinetic energy. So first of all, remember that we know that work is change in kinetic energy and initially the kinetic energy is zero and the final kinetic energy we will we need the answer in that okay so the final k minus k initial will be equals to k e final only because initial it is zero okay and we also know that the graph under the curve that the area under the curve sorry area under the curve of fs is work so we will find the area under the curve so what will be the area of this triangle this will be half into base base is 5 and height is 80 and three triangles are there and all base are same 5 5 5 and height is also same so we will multiply it with 3 so what it will be this is 40 this is 200 200 and 300 uh, 600 so 600 joules is the work now this is the work by the horizontal force on this object there is a force that is horizontal force H and now there is a force of friction now we will find the work done by the frictional force work done by frictional force into distance frictional force is 2 newtons and distance is 50 so it is become 100 joules so the final will be 600 minus 100 that will be 500 joules so if there wouldn't be any frictional force then the kinetic energy would have been 600 but due to the frictional force 100 of the joules would be subtracted from the total work done by the horizontal force okay so according to me the answer would be 500 that is the B option so now we will check the mark scheme and mark scheme says that B option is the right option so what we have done in this question we have calculated the work done by the horizontal force and then we have calculated the work done by the frictional force and when then we I we have subtracted both of the work done and the kinetic energy we got is 500 joules so thank you for watching this video if you have some doubts you can definitely put your doubts in the comment section thank you for watching this video